Well, oh man, that's not scared at all. Look at my A pillar. You like that A pillar action? I know you do. Um, good afternoon, everybody. It's another JFR. This is a lunch JFR. I don't know if I don't remember really doing one of the lunch one. It's always been breakfast or dinner. But um, yeah, no, it's uh. Yeah, I don't know, there's nothing to be excited about, really. It's, uh, I went to, uh, went to Don's for, I did promise this, I did say a previous episode that I would visit another Big Mac besides the double Big Mac. This is not the one that I thought it would be, but it's limited time. I figured I should I should jump on the on the hype train. And uh yeah, I was actually now full admission here. I was going to get a croissant sandwich today, but then I realized, oh, they're probably almost done with the um done with the with the um, chicken Big Mac, so I should get it while supplies last. And I also forgot my gift card at home that I was gonna use with it. So we are here now. And so yeah, there's too many people in the parking lot today. I'm be honest. I did not. It's, it's two a two thirty on a Saturday, which is not great time for this I suppose but um yeah first impressions well it looks like I mean it's your typical McDonald's experience not a whole lot of love and or care was put into the now you can't see it but I'll show you when I take a nibble hold on I'm just getting my fries out that was horribly underprepared for the start of this. I just parked and immediately turned on the camera. So, I mean, lesson is don't do that. But, whatever. Okay, this is okay. They're just not putting ketchup packets in. when you get fries. They're just not adding ketchup packets. And they don't ask you, oh, you want some ketchup with that? They're just not asking. Like, what the, where's the... Where's the common courtesy? I might just have to start keeping a ketchup packets in here. Oh, shit. Just... Got lettuce down my seat crack. I'm trying to keep my car clean here. I try to nice car, you know. So, uh, yeah. Oh, this is what we got. This is what we're working with. Chicken Big Mac. We got the square chicken. My favorite uh, part of a chicken is the square, of course. dropping everything today. Not good. Okay. All that aside, let's get started.
All right. First impression is they managed to make chicken taste like fish. This tastes tastes like uh, they, I don't know what they did. I don't know what they did here. There's something weird going on because it kind of tastes fishy. It is not a fish, a uh, Big Mac. But there are too many people here today. I'm gonna get. I'm gonna start getting self-conscious that they're like watching me. Yeah, okay. It's just immensely, immensely dry. They tried putting a whole lot of their sauce on it. It's not helping. Um, the lettuce is almost non-existent. The chicken is nothing to be writing home about. Um, oh, I haven't gotten a bite with pickles yet by the looks of it. They've got two pickles stacked on top of each other in the very center of the sandwich. So, keep that in mind. Now, I'm not going to rearrange those pickles open up the sandwich. <laughs> that would be tampering with the experience. This is how it was meant to be created in the eyes of the McDonald's crafter. And so I'm going to leave it as is. And now it's time for the pickle bite. Changes absolutely nothing. This is still a... Yeah. I'm incredibly disappointed. I mean, like... It was never going to live up to, like, a Popeye's chicken sandwich. And going in, I knew that. Just because McDonald's chicken is utter shit. <clears throat> it's dog shit. It is not good. I never, now, could be like, oh, this is a big part of my childhood, Jack. How can you say this? Well, it wasn't part of mine because we always as a family went to usually it was A&W or Subway on like a road trip and that's usually when we would get fast food if ever not McDonald's not much and so I'm just not no I'm not a fan this thing I mean is there a market for it maybe let me know in the comments. Speaking of comments, Calum, if you're still watching, because I know you've, you've said you stop watching after the first 30 seconds. I'm calling you out. If you're still watching, comment down below. At uh, 9.50, you watched to 9 minutes 50 seconds. Comment that down below, Calum. Or else you're in some big trouble. No way, that's a bald eagle. I'm literally at the there's a bird there. See that bird? I know it's still on like the face cam. That's a baldy. I swear, I'm not kidding. 
I know my birds. Being... They call me the bird man. They call me bird person. I'm gonna squanch. That's a throwback. But, uh... Yeah. They don't call me that. I don't, I don't feel good about that joke. I don't think that was a good joke that I made. So, just bear that in mind when you're concocting your point of view of this episode of JFR. I'm expecting a JFR tier list to come out from some of you on uh, your favorite to least favorite JFR episodes. I'm expecting that. So, uh, yeah, and then I'll make my own of the ones that I think were my best work. You gotta finish the lettuce. Even the lettuce is shit. Yeah, no, very underwhelming. I'm gonna take one more bite. Just because there might be some... How, a redeeming quality from this sandwich in the last few bites here. You get a lot of cardboard. That's another thing that I should mention. It's just straight cardboard taste. It's all tastes like cardboard. And then the the sauce makes it taste like I don't know. It's like tartar sauce. How it's all combining, which is weird with chicken. I'm not gonna lie. If you could even call this chicken. And so with that in mind, I give this a a solid um solid two bald eagles out of ten gophers that uh, have perished during this 13 minute video I've been watching. I've been keeping count. So uh, take that vegans and have yourself a lovely Saturday.